Hello everyone, I'm Hilary Chin. Thank you so much for coming and watching our YouTube channel. Today, I want to show you how to do skip logic in Kobo Toolbox. It's simple. All you need to do is come up here. We are in our Kobo Toolbox. Please, if you have not watched our video for Kobo Toolbox for beginners, go down below and click the link. Here we go to new because we want to click, um, start a new form from scratch. And we click here and we just come here. We just say demo one. Let's just name this as demo two, sorry. And then we come here, description, we just put hello. And then we come here and we select country. Should be Cameroon, I think. Yeah. You see, and then we select country. And then we select um, the sector here. We select um, education as usual. And then we click create project. When we create our project, it comes here. This is our first form here. So we want to design a skip logic. Skip logic here is just simply um, designing a form and allowing your respondents to skip certain questions that are not relevant. For instance, if I come here and I click and I ask first question and I say their names, let's say I want their names, question mark, and I come here and I choose text because it's open indexed, and I come to the next question and I ask their sex, okay? We want to know if they are female or male. And I come here and then I choose select one. And then here I put um, female. And then down here I put um, male. Okay. And then um, I put it and then I save here. Always make sure you save. Okay. And then I go to the next question and I ask, are you pregnant? pregnant okay um this is going to be text usually um text as well and then i go on and ask another question um are you a worker and then i put another text grid and i save okay amazing okay these are four questions that we want to use to describe and analyze skip logic for you very simple okay now see the magic here now each time i ask this question i want to make sure that this are you pregnant remember if you are a man you cannot say you are pregnant that's something you must know if you're a man it's not necessary for this question to appear if you are a man it's not necessary for this question to appear so what i'll be doing is i want it, i want that each time someone selects male this question should not appear and i want that each time they select female this other question should not appear it should skip because there's no need saying you are a female and then or male and then uh, the another and then the question are you pregnant appears it's not going to make sense so what we do is simple we just come under this question are you pregnant here and we go to settings and we click here and then we come on that skip logic you here yeah, this, this is our skip logic we click here and then we say add condition and then amazingly, we now select, you see, we now go to the question that asks of sex and we click. Now we give a condition. We say we only want this question. This question will only be displayed if the following conditions apply. If this sex is equals to female. Okay. We want to see, are you pregnant only when the question is equal to female? This is the condition we have given and then we delete that. And then we close it, sorry. Now we come to the next question, which is, are you a worker? We also go in there and then we go to skip logic. And then we say add condition. And then we say that this condition will only apply when we click amazingly all the questions. These are questions that we had already set, okay, previously from up here and down. It takes the name, the sex, and are you pregnant? So now we still want to say that this question will only appear if the question sex says male okay so we choose male and then we close it and then we save and then we are going to preview this and then you see how it works if we come here and we preview okay and then we go here you see and then if i say name and i put hillary and they ask me, are you male or female? And I say male. You see, automatically, because I'm male, it's going to ask me, are you a worker? Okay. If I say I'm a female, 
is going to ask me, are you pregnant? You see? So it helps here to clean your data as respondents put their information in your Kubo toolbox. This skip logic is so important, okay? If you are someone who works with Kubo toolbox, please do well to learn it and understand it. It's simple and it helps you clean your data as respondents are putting their data in.